Hey what's up guys, we're back with some exciting news, we'll be taking a look at what is going on regarding the S22 lineup, we'll also be talking about the next big groundbreaking camera innovation that are revealed officially and likely to happen next year. In my opinion, the next big camera innovation for smartphones will be the continuous zoom where smartphones will have zooming capability of a DSLR lens with no loss of quality. We've already seen the camera specs of the S22 series, there's a new 50 meg whistle RGBW sensor which is pretty much confirmed for the S22 and the S22 Plus. As for the Galaxy S22 Ultra, we're not sure if it's rocking the continuous zoom or not but after what just happened, I'm more confident that this might just happen. So Oppo just had their future imaging event where they talked about their future camera innovations and usually when they show off stuff like this, Samsung is always the one that actually brings this stuff in a global product. So Oppo revealed their continuous zoom setup that they're working on. It goes from 85 millimeter to 200 millimeter, which is a pretty strong zoom range, and it has a similar capability as a DSLR zoom lens. The continuous zoom not only provides better quality, but you also get consistent colors and no white balance shift at all, which is something that you see on smartphones all the time when switching between different lenses. Now, similar to Samsung, Oppo is also working on a brand new 50 megapixel RGBW sensor, which they are actually developing in collaboration with Sony. They also also showed off a 5-axis stabilization system, again something Samsung is working on as well. This new stabilization works similar to a digital camera. Now out of all of these technologies, the continuous zoom as well as the 5-axis stabilization will further reduce the gap between a professional camera and a smartphone camera. And like I said in the beginning, all of these things are rumored to happen for the S22 series, so if Oppo is doing, then Samsung can do it as well. We're still 5 months away from the Galaxy S22 announcement, so anything can still happen, we're just going to wait for more news. Moving on, we have a leak that we don't really see that often, which is in 3D. Yes, we have the S21 FE leak now in 3D thanks to Evan Blas. He posted this in all five colors of the S21 FE, which is white, violet, green, gray, and blue. Now, out of all these colors, I really like the white model, but more than the colors, I am very impressed with the bezels of this phone. It looks really, really slim. It's definitely a nice improvement over the bezels of the S20 FE. Now, we have metal on the side, and plastic on the back. Uh, it's going to have that matte finish similar to the S21 series. We also have that triple camera setup similar to the S21 series. And if you see it from the side, it does have a slight camera bump, but not too much. Overall, looks really, really good. Same positioning for the power and volume keys, which is towards the right hand side. Looking at the bottom and on the top, there's no headphone jack as expected, but overall, it looks really beautiful. My favorite one is the white color, but let me know what's your favorite color of the S21 FE. So that's all the latest news. Be sure to comment down below what you think about the S22 lineup and of course the brand new technologies that we discussed. And yeah, with that being said, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.